Hello guys, Mahler back again with another new video and no background lights today, I know. Please don't comment about it. Rather than what I gonna show you today, yet another slider or carousel plugin. Now it is not just only for your React, it can be implemented into React. Uh, then uh, there is a view, Angular and vanilla JS as well. That means basic HTML so let's just draw, dive into it okay now to be honest simplicity is boldness and as you can see in their home page they actually don't have any other thing rather than a slider that is obviously made by their plugin and it says lightweight no dependency only 6k be zipped I mean, z zipped that's crazy okay then you have compatible compatible works in all common browser browser including i10 then you have mobile for support and seriously i have uh like uh visit this website myself in my mobile browser and it's snappy it's really snappy and it works great like i have tried all of their examples and it's really really great and Yes, as you can see, touch friendly and all open source, obviously, MIT license, extensible with rich and simple APIs, then easily creatable, blah, blah, blah. Everything is there and works well with JavaScript, TypeScript, React, Vue, Angular, blah, 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 blah. Everything. Okay. Whatever. Let's see some of their uh, examples because that's, that's what I am excited about because they have really, really great examples. Now, those are default examples, okay. And these are loops, okay. Louis fluid, mean max, blah, blah, blah. These are simples. Now, here something starts from, that is multiple slider. Hmm? And here is multiple slider with space. Now, do you have noticed one thing? It is snapping into places, okay. See? All of the sliders are snapping and it is not looped. Okay. Now, here is a free mode, it will not snap. So, we have that also. Now, free snap mode like scroll freely, but it will snap. Okay. Another great thing then center slider. Everything will be in center. Okay. Let's do three four and all of those are in free mode okay and from now on here is vertical slider as well they are providing that also here are breakpoints breakpoints can be understood here yes see how the breakpoints are working and here is rtl mode here is range see one one two one and have you noticed one thing all of those sliders are really snappy like really really snappy right and scrolling as well like if a slider has a scroll bar it can be included as well so yeah great things and here our like normal server slider with nav bar okay now here comes the main thing like animated things they have really great animations as well here is a fading animation here is lazy loading as you can see and here is zoom out and did you say this isn't it really snappy and here you can uh, use it for uh, like a uh, time bigger as well see those are ios style time speaker as a time picker as you can see it here ios style time picker and here is autoplay and now this autoplay is really too much high speeded i know but yes there is and there is adaptive height as well like as the height of the slides changes 
can be adapted and here is this add and remove sliding see add another one add another one and here is remove see toggle with toggling with and here are miscellaneous there are too many it is endless slider like oh, oh minus infinity to plus infinity great thing right and here is another really great slider see how cool it is and here is another slider that is draggable whoa like i haven't seen like this last example i haven't seen any of the other slider that make this like in wave interface if you can include a draggable slider like this it is great okay so i have showed you literally all of the examples that they have provided here you can go into their documentation they have well documented everything and here is their redoubling visit it i mean the github and it's pretty much up to date as you can see last update is 21 hours ago so obviously the community is working a lot on it actually it has 3k stars so obviously it has something going on so let me start it also whatever so that's it that's it for this video that's it for this slider a uh, few days ago i have showed a uh, frame sevens yeah frame seven slider that is slider dot js nice no, swiper dot js so here is another one keen slider use it i'm going to use it for sure because i like the snappiness more than swiper js i don't know why but it feels really snappy because because the thing is i have tried it uh, beforehand in my phone like i have tried it in my chrome browser of phone so i really really like the snappiness of it and i have 60 giga screen and it is like snapping uh, all of those things so yep i really like those feedbacks so i'm going to use it up for sure for my upcoming projects and for every other project that i going to use <laughs> and that's it that's it for this video actually so If you like my videos in general please do subscribe to my channel and if you know of some of the great projects great great projects open source projects or development things like this please let me know about all of them in the comment section below so i can feature them in my future videos as well so bye for now